Hello guys and welcome to the uh, best build uh, quality uh, LED bulbs you can buy for your house. The uh, Philips uh, vintage LEDs. Uh, these bulbs come in uh, a uh, six pack like you can see right here. This is how the uh, box looks. They are um, the uh, E27 fitting. This is the uh, fitting found in the, um, the vast majority of the uh, house uh, lighting solutions. Uh, they uh, have a uh, warm white light of uh, 2700 Kelvin. So they will uh, really give that um, warm and uh, cozy uh, feeling when you will uh, use them inside your house instead of uh, a uh, cold light which is uh, suitable maybe for the uh, the office areas or uh, as uh, some people do in the uh, rural or countryside uh, used for the chickens to believe that uh, during the night it is still daytime so they will make uh, more eggs so yeah this uh, warm white light of 2700 Kelvin is uh, way better for uh, for your house they um, have um, a very uh, vintage look uh, traditional look so they are just like a uh, incandescent bulb but only uh, 10 times uh, more efficient they uh, light up um, to the equivalent of a 60 watts uh, incandescent bulb but they will consume only 7 watts per bulb uh, also the uh, light output is of uh, 806 lumens so uh, it's really plenty it's more than uh, than enough for a single bulb On the back of the box we can see they are basically the most uh, energy efficient um, LEDs you can buy um, A double plus rated and the uh, warranty is really impressive of 15 years this is why I, uh, I considered Philips to, to really have the best build quality of, of a bulb also, um, from the way uh, you can see uh, they look, uh, they light up in uh, a uh, 360 degree angle and um, really they are, uh, they are really, really awesome. Let's see the inside of the box. Usually they will be a bit more expensive than uh, the other LEDs that have a uh, whitish or a milky uh, glass surface and they will uh, light up in only 200 uh, degree angle so this is the inside of the box you can see they are really uh, nice um, and safe and secure uh, they will not be uh, uh, damaged during shipping unless they are like thrown or something or squished so this cardboard goes up and the bulbs will appear like this Let's take a closer look at one of them. So this is better.
Here you can see the LED uh, filaments. And the uh, E27 fitting. By the way the uh, filament is uh, positioned, you will see that uh, these bulbs are uh, more suitable to light up um, in a uh, vertical position. So uh, no matter how you will uh, put them, like this uh, or like this, it will be perfect. But if you will aim them uh, like this and you will want, let's say, uh, to to use them for the exterior of the house in front of your uh, yard. Um, just be aware that they will not uh, light up very well or as well uh, when you will uh, have them facing uh, this this way. Because here you can see in that part uh, the surface of the LED is really um, very very uh, minimal so the way they will light up very well will be in this area that's why uh, you should uh, think of uh, inst installing and using them in a uh, vertical position and now let's see how they uh, look during the daytime uh, but also at uh, at night. If you would like to uh, purchase this uh, interior LEDs, I will be uh, grateful to you, as always, if you'll use the uh, Amazon links found in the description of the videos as well as in the comment section. For this particular model, I will uh, try my best to find the uh, Amazon links and uh, also place them in the uh, Amazon Influencer link. As always guys, uh, thank you for watching, take care wherever you are. So uh, this is how they look uh, installed. And also a uh, comparison with another uh, Philips uh, LED, but this time the uh, version I was telling you about, uh, the one with only a 200 degree angle uh, lighting surface, and that uh, whitish and uh, milky uh, glass. And now let's uh, have a look of uh, the way they light up. So right now, uh, as the camera records it, the light is um, colder than in uh, in reality, but uh, it is a very a very pleasant light. And really more than enough. So only seven watts. And next, the uh, comparison, the uh, 200 degree angle. I really forgot how much this uh, bulb consumes. It's maybe a bit uh, more powerful, like 8 or 9 watts. But you can see the pattern of the uh, vintage model so there will be some uh, um, shades 
while this one uh, doesn't have any. So I hope this uh, video helps. Uh, no matter which one you would choose, feel free to get whichever is, uh, is more suitable for you. Um, personally, I, uh, uh, I don't think you can uh, go wrong uh, by choosing any of them, as long as you get the Philips quality. So uh, from my experience with the interior LEDs, I definitely recommend you to stay away from any uh, Chinese brand. So the uh, the no name or uh, those uh, China made uh, uh, LEDs. Really, I had a lot of them to burn out after six months, one year, one year and a half. So uh, they really uh, do not last. As long as they state they uh, they will. On the other hand, the uh, the Philips brand never uh, never disappoints, at least in uh, in the build quality um, area. But of course, time will tell. Since uh, these vintage bulbs are just uh, purchased now, um, and the others I've had for uh, really more more than uh, half a year now working perfectly fine if you cannot decide between them my advice would be to um, get the uh, least uh, the cheapest one the least expensive one but uh, for me now uh, the vintage model was purchased uh, at a very good price they were heavily discounted and uh, that's why I've uh, I've uh, went for them. Again, guys, thank you for watching, and take care.